Now, if you don't like skydiving, there's also a terrific aviation museum and an adventure park for kids of all ages. But I was all adrenaline, ready to go. So I asked Wing Commander Randy Walsh about an aerobatic flight in a real tiger moth. Now, Randy, tell us, what's so special about these aircraft? I think it's just the great era that we're missing at the moment. The open cockpit, the biplanes, which you don't see anymore. And uh, they've come out of the 1920s and in between World War I and World War II. And we just try to keep, you know, fun in flying. And uh, this is the way to do it. And what's the view like up there? Well, it gets better and better. And we go all the way through to the Twelve Apostles. So it's a great coastline to fly along, the cliffs, the beaches. It just gets fantastic, whichever direction you go. How many people come and have an extreme flight? We have mild and wild and extreme, and some people just like double extreme. So we basically, the more people want, the more we give them. You lost anyone yet? Never. Lost gloves. <laughs> I've done a bit of skydiving already today. Yeah, but that's for sissies. What? This is your chariot, Super Tiger, extreme aerobatics. Beautiful. You're going up with my son, James. Oh, how old is he? 19, 20. Here we go. You can be my wingman. I'm pumped. It was a bit like the calm before a storm, when you're lulled into a sense of contentment before vroom, you're off again at 4G's doing loop this way and that. You really do feel that pressure. What a rush. Tom Cruise, eat your heart out. Oh, yeah. That was awesome. I felt like I was in a dog fight. We went up in the air, stole the plane, spun around a few times. No vomit. Good. 